How's it going guys? Welcome back to another Anthem video and in this video today we're going to be covering a few aspects that you need to know, namely crystals, tokens and what armor set I've been using among other things. So let's get this video on the road. If you do find this video useful, a like would be greatly appreciated. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you haven't yet. And don't forget to hit that bell to be notified of all content I release and when I actually go live, because I do stream on YouTube and I do stream on Twitch. So if you want to be there when I stream, that is the way to do it. I also have my timetable in my community section. And if it's not done, it should be done by tomorrow. Anyway, rapidly moving on to the video. Right, so today is the final day for you to go and get as many crystals as you can and use them. Whether you have one crystal or a million crystals, you need to use them before reset. After reset, you will lose all crystals. Nothing transfers to the following event, whatever that event may be for the anniversary. They did say something's coming for the anniversary, so we will see tomorrow, hopefully. And hopefully 1.7 will be fixed tomorrow as well, right? Hopefully all of you will actually get 1.7 and we can actually start playing together again because this is probably the worst bug I've seen so far where they've pushed it only to select people and have alienated the community even more than they have already. So hopefully this will get fixed tomorrow and things will get back to normal. Well, typical of how things work, as I was finishing and finalizing my video, an update was finally released by Anthem Game. And it seems tomorrow, approximately at 8 a.m. CT, Anthem will undergo a short period of scheduled maintenance for up to a few hours. They appreciate your patience during this time. It is a scheduled maintenance, but Caden of the House has also confirmed that this maintenance should fix the version mismatch some EU players experienced over the weekend. So we will finally be able to play together again and experience the game as a whole. The mismatch should be ending approximately 8 a.m. CT tomorrow. That is for the GMT player base in the UK, 2 p.m. So hopefully this will finally resolve that. And that being said, Crystals and your tokens are likely to disappear tomorrow. I am hoping the tokens will actually remain intact and continue on in a form for you to get through your dailies because this is a really cool feature and I think it's something that should remain in the game. I really hope the token system does remain in the game. There's absolutely no reason for them to remove this one. I can understand everything else being removed because it's part of the seasonal stuff, but in terms of the tombs, they finally have a purpose now and I think going forward, this is something that should remain as a long-term thing and one that I'm sure the community will appreciate. Leave a daily in there so people can go and do their dailies and actually earn a token through any means necessary. Whether it's going through contracts or going through legendary missions or even just doing generic strongholds twice even to get that token. Whatever it is, it's a nice way for people to actually be able to go and have some semblance of control in crafting their own legendaries. So with that said, I hope that stays, but I can guarantee your tokens will be gone. So if, so here's a full warning, use your crystals, use your tokens, use them before they're gone. Don't cry after reset that your million crystals are all gone. This is your warning, get them done. And just for the record, to set the record straight, Bioware have repeatedly stated in the past that if you don't use your crystals, they will go. The crystals reset for each event that's coming along. So make no mistake, this has been mentioned before and it will happen. Okay, so that is this out the way. My armor set, a bunch of you recently have been asking me in my videos what armor set I've been using. And it is the blockade armor set. I really like this armor set. This is the armor set that I actually called at the time the reimagining of the Legion of Dawn. I think this armor set is sleek, clean, and just classy. You've got different aspects of it, but this is the one it is. And I hope it comes around again so you guys can actually pick this up. There is actually one for each javelin. I only have the Colossus one, as that was the only one I could get at the time. But it is absolutely amazing and one that I highly recommend. When it comes around, you spend some coin and pick it up because it is gorgeous as you can see from here. And it is up there with my favorite sets. So definitely one to look out for, but it is the blockade set. Here are the pieces as you can see being showcased. I've cycled through the pieces so you can see, and I've also demonstrated full circle 
what the complete set looks like outside of the video reel at the beginning. So that covers this. So the big question now arrives at tomorrow. What are we getting? What is coming? Is anything coming? Now, later today, we should be getting a Community Cortex, and depending on what time that arrives, I will get another video out after this one to actually piggyback on this one to give you guys additional information, if there is additional information to be had from it. I simply don't know. By the way, I haven't said anything. The only thing we do know is that they are planning something for the anniversary, so they are hopefully taking it somewhat seriously because we're all anticipating something, we want something, we want them to celebrate the one year anniversary. It's been a rocky ride, you know, the launch wasn't great, everything was has been topsy-turvy, but at the end of the day, the community has stuck with them, the players have stuck with them, the fans have stuck with them, and sure, you'll get the odd fan here and there who wants to just completely and utterly be a twat, and that's fine, they can do that, but they know who their core player base is, and when they complain, they know that it's not coming from a place of toxicity, it's coming from a place of care where they want to see improvements, where they want to see things getting better. It's that community, that side of the circle that they want to appeal to and actually give something back to them. So I do hope tomorrow Bioware does actually do something special for all their players, for all their community and gives back because I think that would be a fantastic gesture from Bioware and something the community will definitely get behind. And that's pretty much it for this video. I wanted to get a short video out there just to let you all know to use your remaining crystals and your tokens. Make sure you use all your tokens. There is no guarantee that the tombs will be there. Make sure you use these. I cannot stress this enough. Use them because if you don't, the crystals 110% will be gone. The tokens have a very, very high chance of going and not coming back. So please use them if you actually care for them and don't get caught out like some people were in the previous event where they had like 500,000 thinking it would transfer to the next event and it didn't. Right guys, that is me for this video. I hope you found this useful, enjoyable and if you did, please subscribe, hit that like button. Don't forget to hit that bell to stay up to date on all content I release. There is definitely more content coming. Strap in. It's going to be a wild ride to 2.0. Finally, I want to add that the giveaway is still undergoing. We have about three days remaining. So if you do want to take part in that, the link to that giveaway, the Anthem Pinheads, is in the description below. Do check it out. Do take part. And good luck in winning. I will announce the winners 24 to 48 hours after the actual event is over. And I'll see you in the next video. Remain Legend. Thanks so much for watching my video. If you look over to the left, you'll find a video that I'm recommending to you that I think you might actually enjoy. On the right, you'll see a video that is recommended by YouTube. I really do hope you enjoyed the video and until the next one, remember to always remain legend.